One of the most closely watched races on this election day is in Nevada, where Senate Majority Leader Harry Reid is facing a tough challenge from Republican and Tea Party favorite Sharon Angle. CBS News national correspondent Ben Tracy is in Las Vegas following the race with the latest. Ben, good morning. Good morning, Maggie. No doubt about it. Harry Reid is in the fight of his political life here today in Nevada. And you know, there's, this race is so close, there's really no way of telling whether or not he's going to pull it out. So to fire up his base, he brought in one of the Democrats' biggest boosters. I am proud to be here supporting him today. Now, Harry's not just a great leader. Harry is a good man. Now, Harry Reid called Michelle Obama his closer. He's hoping she can help get out the vote for him today in Nevada. But, you know, many experts believe Sharon Angle still has the momentum in this race. The latest polls show her up anywhere from one to four points, and her Tea Party base is certainly energized. They've made Harry Reid their number one target in this election, hoping to take down the most powerful Democrat in the Senate. Now, if Reid loses, he would be the first Senate majority leader to get booted from office by his state's voters in 58 years. Years. Thanks to early voting here in Nevada, people have been casting ballots for two weeks now, and it's believed that more than half the people expected the vote have already done so. Now, as for today, Sharon Engel plans to vote in her hometown of Reno, Nevada. Senator Reid will be down here in Las Vegas doing everything he possibly can to get people to the polls. Maggie? Ben Tracy in Las Vegas, thank you. Just one of many races that make today so exciting.